Hey everybody, so today I'm making a different video, different kind of video, that I've never made a video like this before. I just want to make everybody aware of something. Dazed Woozy, the guy who does this bit- I who? want you to know that you are shit human beings! You cannot your fucking opinion! You're the one who the children! Literal children! Who? Yeah, he was hacked recently. Fairly recently he was hacked, and his account, like, he- I don't know what happened. It wasn't a very... I don't think the hack lasted very long. I reached out to Twitter. They were... Or reached out to YouTube on Twitter. They weren't much help. But uh, he got it back in time. He got the account back pretty quickly. But his, his content isn't up. And I have to say, YouTube has been doing a really shitty job with protecting their... Like, L, secure, L security. That's about, like someone in his staff chat said L security. And I honestly could not agree more. It's 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 an, it's just unacceptable because he was there's other channels that are getting hacked by this fucking crypto bot and then it always has that fic, that stupid picture of Elon Musk you know that picture of him you know what I'm talking about you know the hack I'm talking about this needs to be taken care of so I have to just say a couple other things about YouTube YouTube needs to just get their act together okay they need to stop trying to protect protect kids from watching offensive content. Let that responsibility fall onto the parents like it ha used to be back in the day. You remember those days? I watched YouTube when I was a kid. And I'm sure there was some stuff I shouldn't have seen, but I saw it. I mean, my parents were there. They were like, you shouldn't watch this. And they did something about it. Parents these days aren't doing anything about it, and they're going to blame it on the platform. I'm trying to keep this as, sh you know, I'm trying to say this as lightheartedly as possible, but it's hard. I just, I got to say... YouTube needs to stop appealing to lazy parents that are too lazy to, you know, care for their kids. They need to just do their own thing. YouTube used to not be this way. I'm, I, I guess I am happy that they're trying to protect, you know, keep their fan base, keep the fan base, keep their website clean, which is good. You should always do that, but they're just going to so some seriously extreme measures, and they're not paying attention to small things like big thing, sorry, like YouTube channels getting hacked. Another YouTuber who I, who I watched, this happened about a year ago, Stevie, Steve Terryberry, CVT, he got hacked and it was like a crypto, something with crypto, like this guy, someone was talking about crypto and I didn't know who it was, so I unsubscribed and then I went on Instagram and, or something like that and I found out that he was hacked. I was like, oh, that was his channel, went back, subscribed and he lost some subscribers in that time. He, he's okay now, he's, he's more than fine now, he's getting subscribers again and everything. He's a great YouTuber by the way, you should check him out. But this crap happens just too much, okay? They need to stop focusing on appealing to lazy parents that don't want to raise kids, raise their kids, and they just let put that responsibility on the internet. They need to stop appealing to people like that, and they need to get their website fixed. They need to get rid of these annoying comment bots. You know what I'm talking about, the ones that say, click my profile picture, and it's visibly milkers, you know, mommy milkers right there in the profile picture. And it's obviously a bot. And some of these people are just... Some of these bots are just terrible. Like, they respond... Like, on Markiplier's channel, though... I don't even want to talk about it. But they're just terrible. Terrible, terrible bots. Some of them. Some of them are clearly written by people, like, to get attention. Like, any publicity is good publicity to these people. But, anyway, I'm getting a little sidetracked. So, basically, what I'm saying is... Days Woozy's channel was hacked. And it's complete bullshit. I'm happy that he got it back. But his channel isn't... His content isn't up. It might be just unlisted. That's usually how these hacks work. They enlist their content and they rebrand their everything. But I don't know. So just wanted to rant a little bit about YouTube. And I just wanted to bring everybody's a, bring attention to everybody to the situation. Because, I, like I said, I've been working for Days Doozy for a while. I've been editing his videos for, well, not many videos. But I've been editing for him for a while. And he's just cool to hang out with, to talk with. Hang out, it's a bit of a stretch. But he's cool to, you know, chat with and his, you know, in his server. But... And he's, he's cool to work with. But seeing this happen to him is just such a pain. And knowing that it's happening to other people is even more painful. So basically what I'm saying is, YouTube, please stop appealing to lazy parents who are putting the parenting role on the internet so they can go smoke medical, they can go smoke medical marijuana legally and just do whatever they want. You know, you get what I'm saying. They're not doing anything. But that's... You know, it's just a bit of an exaggeration. But anyway, stop appealing to these people and get your website fixed. Get rid of these bots and get bring back the dislike bar. We need that. I mean, you can bring it back on desktop. You can bring it back. But they need, they need to integrate it again. Fix. Get rid of this stupid crypto bot that has, you know, Tesla, that has um, Elon Musk's face. You know exactly what I'm talking about. It happens. It's been happening a lot. Then get rid of that. 
get rid of that. Get rid of the bots as best as you can. Stop appealing to lazy parents and children and focus on the creators that are doing this platform well, such as Days Woozy. He's one of my favorites. So, Yeah, I guess I uh, just wanted to rant a little bit about this stupid situation. And, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Take it easy.